2020, you know, to use the analogy, threw a lot of bullets at us. COVID was certainly a, a major one, and it was something that we all had to adjust to. We all had to adapt. COVID has definitely added layers of complication, right? Complexity to what we do out in the field and uh, the steps that we need to take to ensure that everyone's safe. Uh, our team stepped up in a major way to, uh, to accommodate for it, to, to try to keep folks safe. You know, we worked together uh, to come up with a you know, job site plan of action that was mindful of the need to keep producing, the need to keep meeting our contractual obligations, uh, but also, you know, paramount the need to, to keep people safe. You know, I think it says a lot about the intentionality that we have as a company. I think it says a lot about how we care about each other as a family and want to take care of each other and want to make sure each other is safe. There was a lot of concern initially that, you know, with COVID coming out with the, with the new you know, guidelines and, and requirements and conditions and, you know, sanitation and so forth, um, that we may see a slip in our safety scores, that we may see that those safety ratings come down. But we saw the exact opposite. We saw an increase in those scores. In fact, we've seen more perfect scores this year than I think we probably have as a company. You know, I think HB Construction's always been really good at safety, but now I would say we're great. You know, our teams across the board just have really excelled. It was a crisis uh, because of the COVID situation, and I think that allows the best companies to not just weather the storm and get through it, but uh, to actually improve. And I think that's exactly what happened at HB Construction. I think we got better. I think the more bullets that came at us, uh, the better we got. And, uh, and safety is one of those things that really stood out this year.